You guys, I'm in here and today. I'm going to be showing you this great app. It came out recently. It's pretty great. It's pretty handy. It works just fine. And I know a lot of you guys are going to find this useful and are going to enjoy it. So, without any further ado, let's begin this video. So Sticky is an application um, that came out in the Android market recently. Uh, it costs $1.49 in the Android market, but it's well worth your money. Mainly because this app just lets you stream videos or play videos on your screen while you're multitasking on another app. Let's say you want to watch a video, for example, and every single time you're watching a video, you click home and it goes away. Well, this time you could have a little window popping it up. You can go on another app, you can start watching that video that you want, and you can play an app or a game on your phone while watching a video, which is pretty nice. I find this pretty cool. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm about to show you in a minute. Right now, I'm just going to bring up my tablet. Um, it's a Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1. So if you have this, it's going to work for sure. So this is what it's going to look like when you first open it up. It looks like a bulletin file browser, which they uh, made. And basically right here are all my files on my SD card on my phone. And basically what I can do here is try to find my videos and see if I can play them in a page. For example, if I go to DCIM, those are where all my um, videos are at for my camera that I play on my camera. And if I go into camera, you're going to see I recorded a video. And basically when I tap on that video, it pops like a screen. As you can see, that's, um, that's Creek. And when I pause it, I can just tap on the screen and it pauses. And you can see that it looks just like a... It looks just like a little window on your desktop. And what's pretty cool about this, you could grab it and drag it around on your screen. Mainly, you could just make it bigger, make it smaller if you feel like it. It's pretty nice, it's pretty handy, and I actually do like it. Um, what's pretty cool about this is also that you could um, make it bigger with these little with these little buttons right here. Uh, right now, it looks like a Mac because I have it, the Mac version. But with this, you can obviously tell that um, if you press the yellow one, it's going to minimize it. And if you minimize it, it's going to send it to your notification. And from your notification, you can just tap on it, and then you can just press it again to go back to the video. Also, what you could do is if you press the green button, which is basically um, the plus button, you could just make it bigger when you press the green button right there. And basically, when you tap on it, you can play automatically, and it's going to play really smooth, really fast, and there's no lag whatsoever, um, as you can see. And if you want to smooth, if you want to go more into the video by going forward, you just Go at the bottom and slide your finger to the right. And if you want to go backwards, you go at the bottom again and slide your finger to the left. And then you go all the way back. So I'm right here watching the video, right? Well, if I press home, I can still watch this video without anything happening. And I can just go into another app. Now this works for Android devices as well. Um, it's better to use it on a tablet, but sometimes your tablet or your phone may lag a little, mainly because you're streaming a video or watching a video from your from this application and from anywhere you want but it's always going to be there it's always going to play it's always going to load really fast if you have it downloaded so it's pretty cool it's a pretty nice feature i actually do like it now i haven't even showed you the good part yet all right so i'm going to just go into my gallery and right here i have all my stuff all my videos all my cameras and all that i'm just going to go into my um, videos so let me just find my videos videos and these are the ones i downloaded from an app and basically from here, you could see, and when I tap on one, it asks if I want to play on Stick It. Yes, I do. And you can see I still have the same qualities and the same features. So let me pause it there. Let me open up another one. And yes, I can view it at the same time while watching another video, which is basically called multi-view. I know a lot of you guys are going to find this useful, mainly for the people who like to watch videos a lot. And, not, and don't want to watch it one, one by one. So if you are that kind of person, this is the app for you. Let me just open up another video. And I'm just going to play them all at once. All right, so I have four videos open. Let me just play them all at once. Just play one, two, three, four. All of them running at once. Pretty nice, pretty cool. Pretty nice, pretty easy. Pretty simple, look at that. And as you can see, there could be a little glitches here and there, as you can see right there, to glitch. And I think they could fix that, because it's just a bug, and it's just a fix. And it just and it did come out like a, 
a couple weeks ago, and it's a pretty nice feature. I like it. It's not that bad. And you still have the options to move forward or move backward, whatever you like. And you can just have them all playing at once if you want. And when you're done watching all the videos and seeing how cool they are, you can go into your notification and right there you're going to see stick it. And it's going to say press to close off. Tap on that. All the videos are gone just like that. Pretty nice. Pretty easy. Now, I'm not even there yet with the app. Yes, I still have more to show you guys. Um, let's just open up YouTube. As you can see, this is YouTube from the tablet standard. And I'm just gonna go into my channel, pause it there, and from here, you're gonna see the basic YouTube video. And from there, you can click share, and it's gonna pop up this share option. What you can do here is go, is try to find, stick it, once you find Stick It, you can basically stream the video from your desktop, your an app, or basically anywhere you want. So let me just go home page and I can stream the video right there, right there without no lag. And uh, sometimes there may be some buffering and a little loading, but right now it's not doing anything. It's just playing the video just like it is. So let's go back into Stick It, right? So I'm just gonna show you another tab, which is actually pretty nice. Um, in the settings, which is a tab right there, you're gonna have the option of choosing a multi-view theme. When you choose on that, you can choose to have it. You can choose to have it Windows 7, transparent, or Mac OS. And that's what Windows 7 basically looks like. It just looks like this Windows 7 window. But you need 2.2 and higher, which is highly recommended, mainly because it's gonna lag if you don't have 2.2 or higher. And that's why I think the feature is only for 2.2 devices and higher. So that's when you need to buy a new phone. And sometimes, I'm gonna warn you that sometimes if you have a phone like this and you have more than three videos or a couple more than the average videos that you have in your tablet, it's gonna to start to lag and it might freeze or foreclose on you. On the screen, I'm gonna have a bunch of formats that are supported of the video formats, but I'm not gonna go, I'm not gonna say what they are mainly because I'll sound like a robot and I'll sound a little weird. So I'm just gonna have them on screen right there on screen and basically those are the formats that you could basically do or play and this and streaming is also supported which is basically the YouTube video that I just showed you um, click it pretty cool application in the Android market today um, it's actually pretty nice and in the future you're gonna update it more make it look a little better and a little more less buggy-ish thank you guys for watching we are on Facebook I'll have the link in the description for that we will have more videos of app reviews, tutorials, and basically any other following. And so, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, rate this video a thumbs up if you like it, favorite it, and show your friends, spread the word. And I'll see you guys in the next video.